Everything is alive. The leaves are on the trees, the sun is shining, it's super warm. It's mushroom season. The end of it anyways. Traditionally, Mother's Day weekend is kind of the last of the mushroom hunting season. And you guys know I've been after trying to find mushrooms for the past couple years. Wildly unsuccessful, but there's a lot of woods to walk right here and I just got a good feeling. We're gonna find one. An old arrow. Actually, this is a crossbow bolt. What's funny is you find things you aren't looking for along the way. It's kind of cool. Check this out. That's a big hole. We've got Colin and Sailor down here playing in the creek. Building, What'd you find? I'm building a fairy garden for my grandma for Mother's Dude, Day. That looks like a. That looks like some. You vlogging this? Yeah. <laughs> What you got back there? I'm building a wall. A wall. Have you ever seen those, um, they're like rock balancing sculptures. You just take a big rock and then get smaller all the way up and you balance the rocks into a big stack. We should try that and see how long it lasts. Ooh, that is not the right mushroom though. Bring me one. You want that mushroom? For your fairy house? Yes. Fairy garden, sorry. Okay. This is a smaller one. Can you bring me it? <laughs> sure. This is usually how it goes when I do mushroom hunts. I find mushrooms, but none of them are the ones I'm looking for. Maybe I'm just looking in the wrong place. Well. No mushrooms, once again. It's okay though, we'll keep trying. Eventually we'll find one. I guess I just kinda wanna touch base with you guys real quick. I thank you so much for still hanging out and watching the videos that I do post sporadically when I do post them. And I'll bet you're probably wondering, where have you been, what are you doing? I mean, I mentioned a while ago that YouTube is just not what it used to be. Still a great place to create content and, and post and upload and have immediate feedback from you, the audience, which is so crucial like and humbling. I love the fact that I can post stuff and you guys get to comment. We still get to keep in touch here and there. One of the things that I've been working on is obviously I become the videographer, camera guy, just basically the 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 filmer for, for Roman and these long productions that we've been making. I get to travel the world. I've gone to Dubai, I've gone to China, we have a lot bigger plans in the future, and it's just something that I've been able to exercise my creativity in a way that I probably wouldn't be able to do on my own. On top of that, it's just been really nice being a family. The kids are getting older. Watching them grow is something that I just, I'm, I'm really cherishing the moments that my kids are super young and not filming everything and putting it on the internet. Not that there's anything wrong with that. I love sharing our lives with you. It's just right now, it's kind of time to evolve and take a step in a new direction. Now you can't always expect somebody to pick one thing and then do only that for the rest of their lives, especially in a creative space. You gotta mix it up. You gotta do stuff that keeps your creativity flowing. And for me, just where I stand now, I really have a strong passion in showing you guys different tech and, and cameras and film and equipment and all that stuff is very, very important to me and it really sparks my creativity. Ultimately guys, I just, I've, I've kind of taken a step back and, and just living myself, my own life in the moment and, and enjoying life and I feel like you guys should do the same thing too. I want you guys to know that I'm still here, I'm still gonna be creating and I wanna inspire you guys in maybe a different way and I hope you guys can gravitate towards that because I, I really do appreciate each and every one of you who watch these videos and you smack that like button and you are subscribed. Very frequently uh, I play video games on Twitch. We seem to have a lot of fun. The community there is very, very positive and constructive and uh, if you haven't yet already, please follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Gilroy Gaming. Okay, enough talk. We, we gotta go get uh, with the family. Wind's picking up, dark clouds. I hear a little bit of thunder in the distance. Usually in Ohio, when the, the weather starts getting nice, it's springtime, 
it starts to get really hot and humid. And with that comes pop-up thunderstorms. There's the family. What'd you find, Liza? I got this and I want to pick it. Oh, pick don't it. pick it. You gotta let it grow. Show Ooh. Daddy what we did pick. Those are pretty. It's lilac. It smells good. We <laughs> just missed Erica. Oh yeah? She's off to prom. They're growing so big. Senior prom. What are those? Bleeding hearts. What are those? This is one of my favorites. They are pretty. Mm -hmm. Carson, what happened? I have strep throat. Oh no. He just went to the doctor. Veronica took him strep throat. We're gonna have to go home. <laughs> it's a good thing too because it's just started raining. Liza, are you playing in the rain? <laughs> I hear some thunder. <laughs> are you scared? You can play in the rain when it's not thundering. Okay? Oh, that's funny. Okay, so um, we had other plans, one of which was to go hang out with Scott and Lindsay and do a cookout over there, but we don't want to take we don't want to take Carson because he's got strep throat and we kind of gotta quarantine. Sucks, man. Grill Master Gil is on the clock, Liza. You ready? Yeah. So what do we have on the grill for tonight? Well, it's that barbecue chicken. Well, some of them aren't barbecue because kids are picky, but look at that. Mmm. There is not enough barbecue on that chicken. We use tenders because the kids like them and they cook really fast. Of course, I like to have a nice big leg or a breast with the skin on, get it all crispy. Oh, super good. But we don't only have chicken, we also have corn on the cob. That's Velveeta mac and cheese and this is Trolls mac and cheese. Mmm, okay. Two different mac and cheeses. And one of my favorites down below. Can you see that? Oh, foggy. That's sweet potatoes. Roasted sweet potatoes. I'm actually gonna make a little melted butter, cinnamon sugar drizzle to put right on top. <laughs> yeah. Are you getting sleepy? Liza, are you getting sleepy? <laughs> Look at her. Look what she's doing. She sucks her thumb, right? And she puts she puts any t-shirt graphic like in her hand. It's so weird. She's done it since she was born. She like she grabs onto hold of like a t-shirt or a piece of a piece of her it blanket has to or whatever. Be a texture. Yeah, not like, this because how her shirt's sparkly. Yeah, like no. not even that. No. Nope. She's weird. I don't it's know what to say, but she's my princess and I love her. It's gonna be like a caramel, like a like a thick like a like a. It's so sugary. What is that? You don't need a lot of cinnamon. Cinnamon's strong. Cinnamon, brown sugar, butter, How's that? drizzle. How about it? Uh. <laughs> Welcome to dinner with the Gilroys. That's how we do it. Maybe it's probably not the healthiest, but it tastes so good. Why are you wearing heels in the kitchen? Because <laughs> Liza brought them to me. She's here, Mom, you can wear these. I've never seen you wear heels with jeans. Yo. Barbecue chicken and ice cream. Mm -hmm. This oh, night oh, is great. amazing. We're we're just finished dinner. Like I said, Carson, legit. We woke up this morning. We're like, we're gonna have the best day ever. And on the way uh, to go mushroom hunting, Carson's like, I I don't feel good, and he got worse and worse. Turns out he actually has strep throat. So we're stuck. Ice cream and movie night. Would you pick? Eliza picked Harry Potter. Oh boy. Anyways, Carson's got antibiotics. I mean, we need to just nurse him tonight and we'll carry on after the sunset to actual Mother's Day. For you, babe. Okay. What do you Daddy, think? 
Liza, do you like this outfit? Yeah. I, I think it looks great. Oh, uh, yeah. It looks amazing. What do you think? Get by the black. Happy Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day. We're making stuff for you. Look what Liza made. Our Play-Doh? What are those? They're eyeballs. Eyeballs? We're starting the day with... I want all the cheeseburgers. You want all the cheeseburgers? Yes. We're starting with Play-Doh. And look what Mommy got for Mother's Day on the counter. The flowers and balloons. Yeah, big old balloon. So what is this? It's a cabbage patch. A uh, sign. Oh, that's actually really good. Yeah. I like it. Give me the bear. So it is currently, as we're filming this, Mother's Day, guys. And don't just celebrate your mom on Mother's Day. Moms are moms 364 other days of the year. Make sure you always give moms a big hug. Let them know you love them. And uh, just appreciate them, because without them, you wouldn't even be here. Literally my least favorite thing of every single day. Finding socks. I can never find socks. And this dad, basket dad, right here? Dad, 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 what, 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 I what? found something. There's a lot of socks in here. It's of match. just my Barbie thing. And That's our Barbie thing. Woo! Are you ready to go out to eat? Yep. Alright, let's go. Okay, but before we go, I have to show you this picture. See this photo right here? This uh, we created for my mom for Mother's Day. And a little bit of Photoshop, but this was like a drone shot that we did. It was a few a few days ago or something. Yeah. But we're getting the whole family together to go out to eat. And and by the time it's over, we're going to be like, Mom, we got to stop by Walmart together and pick up this photo for her. All right, let's go eat. <laughs> oh, and here we are, dudes. Are you guys ready to feast? We, yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. Carson, how are you feeling, first of all? Um, I feel like I feel normal. You feel normal? Good. Perfect. Colin, how about you? Hair's looking sharp, right? Oh. Hey, who's in this car? Hey. Are you there? Liza's still wearing her Moana stuff. Mama. Yes, I'm here. How are you? We went around and around, but I'm here. I'm I know, I, I beat you, and you guys were well ahead of me. Oh, well. <laughs> the other place we were gonna eat was Obviously, it's yeah, Mother's Day. They're super busy, so we're going to Golden Corral. Your hair's a little crazy, yeah. <laughs> Barbo, there, there's my dad. Look at him! Look at him! Look at him! Look at him! Wait, wait, wait! Hi, baby. Excuse me, miss. Yes. <laughs> mom, happy Mother's Day, mom. Thank you. We made it. What did you get me? Can I hold it for you? I'll hold it for you. Oh, okay. I'm holding right. it. We came here just for you. Yeah. Hey, Marge! Hi, Marge! Did we take over the restaurant or what? It's like we're the biggest party here. I've had a few plates, but now it's time for my favorite part, and that is dessert. Look at this place. What did you get? I dipped my. Dude, that's a mess. It, was, it wasn't. It was Look at my other one that I made in there. It's up there or back there? Carson, you're not supposed to make that big of a mess in the chocolate fountain. I know. Okay? Just, you gotta dip like a marshmallow in there or something. We've got cakes. I'm gonna go in for that. Some oh, carrot cake. That. You can dip some stuff in chocolate, cookies, pies, puddings, all the, everything. All the good stuff. All the good stuff. It looks like too many kids have hit the chocolate fountain. They're getting out of control in here. Ready? We got the goods right here. Mom? What? This is for you. Okay. That's very cool. Very, very cool. You like it? I do. Does it come out good? Yeah. That's pretty decent. Cool. Sir, what do you think about that? <laughs> what do I think about it? <laughs> so the, the consensus is we gotta make it bigger. It's gotta be like a mantelpiece instead of just a shelf piece. <laughs> Eliza hijacked my dad. Look at her. Oh, where'd he go? Look. Look, she's stringing him around. <laughs> Grandpa, look at this doll, Grandpa. I love this doll right here. Oh, that's cute. It looks great on the shelf back there. 
Got to the checkout line, Veronica's like, you didn't find your snack. And I'm like, oh crap, I don't even know where it would be. And it's legit right here. There it is. This is, uh, you remember Harley Morstein, yeah. Epic Mealtime? So this is a new snack that he's come out with. And I'm gonna get, bed. I'm gonna get each kind so we can try them. Okay, it's time. This is pepperoni pizza. Man. Tastes like pizza. Buffalo style. Spicy. Ooh. That's real spicy. Supreme. Pretty good. It's kind of strange though. Jerky for me, like, should be dry. This stuff's like moist. It's almost like it was soaked in spaghetti sauce or pizza sauce. I don't know. Give it a try. This is our this is our YouTube friends creating actual snacks you can find in the real world. I believe you can find these in all WalMarts, most WalMarts. Uh, give them a try, man. Support support the community. I like them. This is pretty much the extent of our activities for the day. It's mom's day. So yeah, we're gonna spend the rest of the day playing with Peppa Pig, building Legos, maybe a little video games, just hanging out. Did you have a fun Mother's Day? Yeah. Yeah? That was very nice. <laughs> very nice indeed. That, my friends, is where we're gonna call it for this video. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. We will see you right back here next time.